Hey everyone, this is to help all first violins play ninja. So in the very beginning, your pizzicato, I would maybe wrap my bow into my palm like this and then use my thumb and index finger to pitz. So my thumb would go at the edge of the fingerboard and my pointer finger would pluck. Or you can hold your bow and put your pointer finger out, tilt your palm in and pluck like this so it's easier to go to arco. However, I think that in the amount of rest that you have at measure nine, you should be able to go from here back to here without any problem, okay? So I'm gonna pizzicato like this, all right? Here we go from the beginning. You have one finger down on the A. One, two, ready, and one, 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 three, one, zero, one, rest, shh, rest. One, 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 three, one, zero, two, one, D, shh, rest. One, 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 zero, one, rest. One, 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 three, one, rest. One, 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 zero, one, zero, one, rest, shh, rest. Cellos come in, seconds come in, then first. Rest, rest. Okay, so let's stop there. So at measure nine, right, the cellos come in. Do, day, do. Then the violas and seconds come in. Do, day, do. Then we come in. Do, day, do. Do, day, do. Do, day, do. Rest, rest. Everybody rests those last two beats of measure 11. So if you find yourself playing, you're going to have an unintentional solo, which we don't want, okay? Other thing is, make sure that on your string crossings or your, your, your going from D string to A string on the pizzicato, make sure you do it during the space of the rests, not on the note, right? So by that I mean, let's say for instance, measures uh, six and seven, you have one on D, one, 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 three, one, then over to the A string during the rest, not as soon as the note's supposed to happen, okay? All right. Um, good, let's go from measure 12, right? You have do, do, day, do, do, day, do, 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 day, do, do, day, do, day, do, day, do. Clap your rhythm, say your rhythm, however you need to do it to make sure you play the right rhythm and not something else, okay? So here we go from measure 12. Ready, one on A, two, here we go. One, one, three, one. One, three, one, zero, two, zero, one. One, three, one. One, three, one, zero, two, one, two. And remember, if that, if you're not getting it, you practice two notes at once, multiple times, then add another note. Then another note. Then another. Until you get there, right? Or practice in rhythms. Da, 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 dum. Da, 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 dum. However, you need to practice it to make sure you get your fingers fast, right? Do, day, do, day, do. Rest. Then we go right on to 16, okay? All right, so let's go from measure 12 one more time and try to take it all the way to 20. Here we go. 12. One, two, first finger on A. We have one, one, three, one. One, three, one, zero, two, zero, one. One, three, one. One, three, one, zero, two, one, two. Rest. One on D. One, three. Now either four, open A. One, three. You have to continue moving through those notes. You can't take time going at all, right? You have to just keep going because then 20 happens in like a matter of seconds, okay? So let's go one more time from 16. And if you stopped at all, you gotta keep going, okay? If you miss a note, it doesn't matter. You keep going. Here we go, 16. One, two, ready, and you have do. Do, 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 do. because we had a lot of rhythm trouble, at least in my class, in orchestra, okay? So that means that at 20, you can't take this hyperspeed. It's not da, 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 da. Stretch those notes out. Do, 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 rest, huh, right? There's no prize for playing the fastest. There's no prize for getting done the piece first, okay? When we get to 26, you have do, day, do, day, do, rest. Do, day, do, day, do, rest. Do day do, do day do, do day, do day, do day, do day, do day at 30, 
okay? All right, second thing is at 26, you need to make sure that you can play all those notes, right? So again, you might want to play in rhythms. <laughs> sure you get those notes. Maybe you just do one measure at a time. Maybe at 29, you just add a note every time. Right? Or, sorry. Right? So you're going to want to practice that in adding a note one at a time, right? Four, two, four, two, one, but practice those repetitions multiple times, okay? Good. All right. That's tricky. I would definitely plan to work on 20 to 30. Let's go from 30. You have do day rest, do day rest, do day rest, 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 do day rest, do day rest, do day rest, rest, do day, do day. It's not always the same thing. You've got to really look at the rhythms that are there. Okay, so let's go from 30 to we can go all the way to 38. Here we go. One, two, 30, and B D rest, B D rest, B D rest, now D rest. Rest. Now D to C. D, D, rest. Rest. Now one to three. And then four or open. One, three. A, G, E, G. A, G, E, G, F. Right? A, G, E, G. Hunter's chorus is the same thing. A, G, E, but this is just a different pattern. Notice that I'm stressing the A to make sure we get there on beats one and three. Right? One and two and three and four and. Yeah, you need to make sure that you get to those A's in time, okay? Again, you'll look at that in rhythms. Adding note one at a time, whatever you need to do, okay? Write in notes if you have to. Practice measure by measure. Then we get to 38, where you have slow bow, slow bow, slow bow, slow bow, do, 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 day, do, day. Rhythm is important, right? Let's go from 38. One. Two, two, one, D. We have two, then three, then two, then A, then two, one, two, 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 three, two, one, two, three. Okay, if you were faster than me on the quarter notes, that's not the right rhythm. It's not eighth notes, it's quarters. Okay, if you were faster than me on the half notes, not the right rhythm. Half notes are worth two full beats, right? Okay, let's try one more time from 38 and then we're gonna go all the way to 20. Ready? One, two, ready, and we have 38. Then three, then two, then A, then two, one, two, 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 three, two, one, two, three, one, zero, two, zero, one, rest, huh, then one, three, two, zero, two, rest, huh, rest, one, zero, one, three, one, rest, huh, now, one, zero, one, two, three, rest, three, two, three, zero, one, then three, one, zero, one, zero, two. Okay, so let's start from the coda. Ready? So that's one, 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 right? Do, do, day, do. Think the rhythm in your head as you go. Here we go. Ready? Three. Coda. One, two, first finger. One, 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 three, one, 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 three, one. Then we have one, zero. Now we plop. One. Notice how for this, I went back to just using my pointer finger, right? Um, because you probably go to the bow more quickly towards the end of this piece, maybe you just want to use this. But if you think you need more control, you play, wrap the bow, then you pluck. Rest, shh, like the beginning, right? Rest, shh, A, B, rest, shh, A, B, rest, B, rest, B, use the bow, three, two, one, 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 rest. Two, one. And you should say ho at the end there, right? So be careful of that three, two, one. Rest. And again, it's ho, okay? But I'm just making sure that you don't play 